Maria asked 40 students in her class about their favorite sport. Here were the replies. Four students liked swimming. At least six students liked basketball. And twice as many students liked soccer more than basketball. We're asked to complete the pictograph below and answer the question. So notice for the pictograph, each red X represents two students. And we're asked to answer the question, there are how many more students that like soccer than like swimming? So there's a lot of information here, and it might be easy to get overwhelmed. Let's just take it one step at a time. Notice how we know that exactly four students like swimming. Let's record this in the pictograph. So because four students like swimming, and one red X is equal to two students, we would use two red X's to represent the number of students that like swimming. Again, four students like swimming. So if there are 40 students in the class, and four of them like swimming, notice that 40 minus four would be equal to 36, which means 36 students either like basketball or soccer. And again, we also know that at least six students like basketball and twice as many students like soccer than basketball. So to finish up this question, let's compare the number of students that like basketball and soccer using a table. Let's let B equal the number of students that like basketball and S be equal to the number of students that like soccer. Again, we know twice as many students like soccer than basketball. So because we know at least six students like basketball, Let's say there were six students that liked basketball. If there were six students that liked basketball, then twice as many like soccer, because six times two equals 12, 12 students would like soccer. But because six plus 12 is equal to 18, and 36 students remain, this would not be the correct number of students that like basketball and soccer. So let's try a different number of students that like basketball. Let's try seven. Well, if seven students like basketball, then seven times two are 14 students like soccer. Seven plus 14 is equal to 21, which is not 36, so this cannot be correct. Let's jump to 10 students like basketball. That means 10 times two are 20 students like soccer. Well, now we're getting closer, but notice that 10 plus 20 is equal to 30, and we need 36. So let's try again. Let's try 11, which means if 11 students like basketball, 11 times two are 22 students like soccer, and 11 plus 22 is equal to 33, not 36, so we try again. Let's try 12 students like basketball. Well, that means 12 times two are 24 students would like soccer, and now we have it because notice that 12 plus 24 is equal to 36, which is the exact number of students that remain in the class of 40. So now we know that 12 students like basketball and 24 students like soccer. I'm just recording this information here so we can keep track of the information. And now to complete the pictograph, because one red X is equal to two students and 12 students like basketball, we would have six X's to represent the 12 students that like basketball. Two, four, six, eight, 10, and 12 students. And because 24 students like soccer, we would have 12 red X's. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, and 24 students. And now for our last question, it asks, how many more students like soccer than swimming? Well, we now know that 24 students like soccer and four students like swimming and 24 minus 4 is equal to 20, so 20 more students like soccer than like swimming. I hope you found this helpful.